Welcome in, ladies and gentlemen. This afternoon at Clayton High School, Madison Swindler signed a letter of intent to continue not only her education, but volleyball career at Clark University over in Atlanta, Georgia. Now, number one, congratulations. Thank you. Now, Madison, quick question here. You were going over to Clark to play with the Panthers. Did any of the schools show any interest in you? And if so, who were they? Um, I got a couple emails here and there from like small schools. Um, I'm actually not sure of the name of that school. Okay. I didn't really show any interest after. Is Clark the only one you visited? Yeah, that's the only one. What stood out about them that made you really maybe not want to take a look at the other schools? Is there anything in there in particular over at Clark that you liked? Um, I like how like it's right beside Spelman and Morehouse, so it's a mixture of all kinds of schools and it's just a lot of people there and then I wanted to go to HBCU too, so it was just checking all my boxes. Well, that's good that you checked all the boxes you had in the back of your mind. Mm -hmm. Now, what position have you been playing here at Clinton and have the coaches told you what position they want you to play on the volleyball courts over there? Um, at Clinton I've been playing outside all four years and some back row but um, I think up there she said outside and maybe a little back row maybe a little right side too so it's kind of in the air right now. Oh, okay have they told you anything to be working on before you get there any kind of exercises drills or anything they want you to do before you get there? Um, she didn't say anything specifically but I'm still playing club ball in the off season you know to stay ready for next season. Oh, club ball. Uh, where's the team based out of? Greenwood, South Carolina, FCA, Upstate Volleyball. How's it doing? It's doing pretty good. Um, we haven't started any tournaments or anything yet, but we're just practicing right now. Now, so far we've been talking about you going over there and playing volleyball. We also, You're also going over there for an education. Mm -hmm. Have you thought about what you would like to do as a major, and then when you get out of college, what you'd like to do as professionally with that major? Um, I know when I get out of college, I do want to own my own business, actually multiple businesses. So I'm going to major in business, um, specifically entrepreneurship and minor in fashion because I want to have like my own clothing brand and everything. Huh. Okay, well that was going to be my next question. What kind of business that you wanted to go into and own so you want to get into fashion and clothing? That's interesting. Yeah. Okay. Now, uh, one thing I'd like to ask you, thinking back over your volleyball career, here at Clinton High School, which this past year was pretty successful. Is there any one moment, game, match, or anything that kind of stands out in your mind that you'll probably never forget as long as you live? Um, actually, it was a practice this year, actually. We did um, Halloween practice, and everybody dressed up, and everybody was all like with costumes and stuff. I think uh, Cameron Birch and Sydney, they came in with like tutus and aprons. I forgot what they were, but that was fun. I'll never forget that. Well, what did you come as? A hippie. A hippie? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did anybody get any pictures of that? Yeah, we did. Now, that Got might be interesting pictures. to share with the public yeah. anyway. So. All right. You gentlemen have any other questions you want to ask her? Yeah. Uh, Atlanta is uh, not only sort of the, it's sort of the academic camp, capital of HBCUs. There are a lot of really distinguished people who went to co went to co college in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. Martin Luther King went to more Morehead for more Morehouse Morehead plays PC. <laughs> but um, what is and I assume it's now not just Clark but Clark Atlanta because because yeah, I, I the, but um, and also Atlanta is without question the center of African American culture in the United States. Mm -hmm. It's the capital of hip hop and rap. It's the capital, there's a, a, it's, it's a movie capital. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, it's sort of like, it's, it's sort of the most significant city in America for African Americans. Mm -hmm. Being there, is that got something to do with it? You wanna, I mean, you're talking about fashion. Mm -hmm. Well, you should be able to see a lot of cutting edge fashion. Is, do you want to be in Atlanta? Yes, I do, and I want to surround myself with people that kind of have the same mindset goals as me too. That way, you know, I get an idea of like how I can manage there. Okay. Anything else, Ellen? 
Well, once again, we'd like to congratulate you on doing the work not only on the volleyball court, but in the classroom to get to this position and wish you nothing but luck. Thank you.